my parents had run the bull for 28 years before I and my husband, Mervyn, took over in April 1969. We had only been there for three months when we heard that the quarry was to close. I remember the day well, getting up in the morning and fetching the newspaper from the door. My husband and I got the shock of our life. What were we going to do? With two daughters still at school, we depended largely on the quarrymen for our livelihood. It was a great shock. The Bull was a great pub to run. No trouble, big or small. There was plenty of fun to be had listening to the old quarrymen tell their tales. And in the evening, there would be singing. The boys from the band would come in after their practice and join in. There was a good sense of community in the village. Of course, everyone knew each other's business, but they were willing to help each other. There were small shops along the high street, all of which have closed by now, even the post office. The closing of the Dinorwy Quarry changed the village of Danielin. Work did come to the village and the area with the Marklin scheme, but it also brought many English incomers to the village. It was a pity to see many people leaving the village to look for work, leaving their families behind. My husband and I ran the bull for ten years, and after his death I ran the bull myself for a further twelve. Twenty-two years of happy memories. <laughs>